back to my video. Uh, I am Francesca Tracia, so I'm going to do a research about a fixes on song lyrics in the Zeus I'm OK album. So I'm going to talk about the table of contents, which included the chapter 1, the introduction, chapter 2, the review of related literature, and chapter 3, the methodology and the references. So I'm going to discuss about the background of the study. Uh, we encounter language in our daily life. It's one of the tools for having such conversations to other people in order to fulfill our needs. It, it obviously plays such an important role in society since the language contributes with words. Therefore, the words in language is crucial. So the analysis of the affixes on song lyrics in the Seuss I'm OK album will reveal the meaning behind the songs through the words in its lyrics. And by listening to the song along with the reading and the lyrics of the song, it will also enhance and enrich our vocabulary. So these are the problems of the study and the objectives of the study. The problems of the study are what are the affixes found on song lyrics in the Seuss I'm OK album. And the second question what are the function of affixes on song lyrics in the series I'm okay album and for the objectives of the study are to describe the affixes that are found on song lyrics in the series I'm okay album and to find the functions of affixes on song lyrics in the series I'm okay album so the third one is the scoop of the study this research focuses on affixes on song lyrics in the series I'm okay album so in the song lyrics of I'm okay album by the suit consists of nine songs. The writer takes all of the data or the examples of fixes that have been classified and put into the table. The researcher re searches then describes the words which are related to affixes and also the researcher explains the function of words formation based on affixes. And the last part for the chapter one the introduction is the significances of the study. The result of the study is expected to give contributions to the related study both theoretically and practically. Theoretically, the result of the study is broadening knowledge about affixes of English words and practically, the result of this study is expected to be additional reference for other researchers, especially for students of linguistics and other further study about the related research and it's hope for get a better understanding of the content of lyrics in affixes so I move on into chapter 2 the review of related literature and in chapter 2 I'm going to discuss about the morphology morpheme types of morpheme the affixes and the song lyrics So I'm going to discuss morphology from some experts. According to Bauer, morphology is about the structure of words, how words such as dislike are made up of smaller meaningful elements such as this and like. Another research is from Liber. Liber stated that morphology is the study of systematic cooperation in the form and meaning of words. So from the two experts, Bauer and Liber, I can conclude that morphology studies about words and also the structures from each words. So there is the expert. According to Liber, morpheme is the manifold units that are used to form words. And for the second expert by Bouge, according to him, morpheme is the morphological building blocks of words. So from the two experts, Liber and Bouge, Morpheme can be concluded as the smallest unit of language that has its own meaning. So there are three types of morphemes. The first type is free morpheme, bare morpheme, and derivational morpheme. Free morpheme is a word that can stand alone since it has meaning. Bound morpheme is a morpheme that must be attached to another morpheme to receive the meaning. And the last is the referential morpheme, is a process of changing words into a new words 
by adding FX. Since free morphem can stand alone, so the word can have its own meaning like walk, health, coat, and shoes, and etc. So the bell morphem has to be attached with another word, and the example is re, play, on, able, chip, per, climb. So the process in the revisional morphem is the changing words into a new word by adding affix. So the example is obviously by adding the li affix and drinking ing and remember the re affix. Then I'm going to discuss about the affixes. Affixes are a part of morphem which constructed a word formation and new meaning. For example, miscommunication, binary, absurdism, teacher, preference, and etc. There are two types of affixes. The first one is prefix. Prefix is the affixes which can be added to the beginning of a word. For example, antibiotic, miscommunication, and binary. And for the second types of affixes is suffix. Suffix is the affixes that can be added at the end of a word. For example, absurdism, teacher, preference, and etc. According to Lakoff and Johnson, they stated that song lyric is when words and sentences are written down and they can be readily looked upon as object. And another expert is Hombi. He stated in his book that song is a spot poem of number of verses that the music and intended to be sung. After some explanation from the experts, it can be concluded that song lyrics is the word lyrics defined by writer's state of emotion, whether it's a happiness or sadness. Thereafter, I move on to the research method. The research method is included research design, source of data, the procedures of data collection, and the techniques of data analysis. So from the chapter three, research method, there are research design and the sources of the data. The research design used a descriptive qualitative method. This method focuses on the descriptive data, like people's own written or spoken words and observable behavior. And the sources of the data is taken with questionnaire, interview, opinion, documentation, and etc. But in this research, um, it is collected by documentation in the library and internet. And for the third and the fourth part of this chapter research method, there is the procedures of the data collection and the techniques of data analysis. The procedures of this data collection is collecting by the lyrics of the Sue Band in I'm OK album from musicmatch.com and the techniques of data analysis is using the objective approach in which the analysis based on the sum of the Sue's lyrics the data is analyzing descriptively using a fixist theory so this is the last part of the research the references that I take from some experts to complete my research. So that's all. So that's all about my research. I hope you can understand better about it. Uh, and yeah, thank you for watching. Bye.